I went down, my brother works for the police in Bristol, and, uh, and he said, will you come down the... the Avon and Somerset, big police headquarters was yes. open. Like Willy Wonka's chocolate factory, open for the first time ever. Come in and ever. see what's Come in and have a look on. what's behind the gates. So he said, will you come down? So uh, there were about 3,500 people down there, there police cars and all sorts of stuff. And I said, yeah, I'd love to. And then he said, will you, um, will you get attacked by a police dog? Yeah, of course. All right, then, if that's, uh, if that's what you want. This is my rehearsal for the uh, being attacked by a police dog. There you go. Shoot the gun, and then the dog comes at you. There you go. Ah! Now, the guy's saying, drop the gun, drop the gun, but I've got ear defenders on, I can't hear him. Look at it! It's shaking you about like a rag doll! He's saying, drop the gun, yeah. Philip, drop the gun, drop the gun. What? Drop the gun. Oh, all right, then. <laughs> Does that hurt? I mean, can you feel... I know you've got a big padded that's suit a big, on. Uh, that's amazing. That's a big padded suit with, underneath that, was a leather armlet type so of thing. So you're properly covered. And I could feel its teeth through really? all of that. You wouldn't want to be on the receiving end of that. My fear anger. is, you wear all of that and it goes for your leg. It's trained, <laughs> it's trained to go for your arm. I know, but what is an animal? What if it doesn't? I just love the fact that for a little starter pistol, I had to wear headphones <laughs> and I've got a dog hanging off my arm. <laughs> uh, health and safety. Uh, thank you to everyone I met. I had an amazing day. It was really fantastic, so thank you.